when you actually get a piece of the moon in the palm of your hand, it really is a magical feeling. And everyone looks up at the sky and the moon is the most, you know, most common object that people see and have wondered about since the dawn of humanity. And having a piece of it in your hand, it almost transports you there. It really is a magical experience. Most meteorites originate from the asteroid belt between Mars and Jupiter. Uh, occasionally, scientists have been able to, to pin down a celestial body that they think they come from. Uh, fortunately, we've, we've sent astronauts to the surface of the moon, and NASA has brought back lunar material. Uh, you know, since the 70s, we've been able to analyze the composition of, of that material, and these lunar meteorites conform exactly to to those NASA specimens. These are otherworldly objects. It's not an everyday occurrence that you interact with these. And then when you see these ones, which really are the, the best and most beautiful meteorites um, available, they, they can become addictive and people start collecting in this field. In, in terms of rarity, it is worth stressing that meteorites are incredibly rare. The, the total known weight of all meteorites on Earth is less than our annual gold output. And if you think how, what a premium we put on gold, we're producing more gold annually than all the meteorites we've ever discovered. <laughs> 